review the service mode option on this appliance. As part of the installation, we're going to require that we get a sample of the combustion, uh, meaning CO and CO2 levels, and we are requesting this in high and low fire. So we have the ability in this control to control the fan speed. Um, so what, what we do to get into this is simply press and hold S2 and S3 simultaneously, and this will access the service mode. It will show you the three-digit fan speed multiplied by 10, of course, is your RPM value, and it will show you service on the screen. Once the combustion system has initiated and flame has been proven, it takes about five seconds. It will allow you to control the fan speed up and down. So in the install manual, it will show you exactly where your high and low fire RPM should be. So we will match that to this is what we're seeing on the screen as to being correct. And as you can see, hitting the S2 plus button will raise the numbers up and increase the fan speed so we can put this unit at its highest firing rate. And so it will allow us to take our combustion samples at high fire. And once we have that information, we utilize the S1 minus key to bring the fan speed down to its lowest firing rate. And we can get this information, record our CO and CO2 levels, and the combustion testing is done. The service mode will last 10 minutes, and then it will drop you out of there. It will also not allow you to override set point temperature, so you definitely want to start with a cold tank, give yourself a little bit of time to get the sampling done. Once you have completed your testing, simply press S1 and S2 simultaneously and control goes back to normal operation and you have exited service menu.